Hello and welcome to another video by Scalar. I am Abhishek Vijayvergia, Senior Data Scientist at Microsoft. In this video, I am going to tell you the difference between data scientist and machine learning engineer. If you are new to this channel, I would highly recommend to subscribe and turn on the notification so you won't miss any upcoming videos. Also check Scalar events where free masterclasses are taken by industry experts. Let's get started. A data scientist is in charge of generating actionable insights from the data and building accurate machine learning model that can help the business grow. A machine learning engineer is a professional that takes next step and put this model into the production that faces the user queries directly. While data scientist and machine learning engineer have a lot in common, their pathway differs early from their career itself. Consider these two relationships as passing of a baton. Data scientists use a statistical technique to develop the right machine learning strategies. They also identify right model to feed into the machine learning model. Machine learning engineer takes the next step and put that model into the production where and it ensures the model works correctly. Data scientists have a STEM background or even higher degrees such as PhD in biology, mathematics to name a few. Machine learning engineers are having the background in software engineering. Machine learning engineers are specialized in scalable software engineering such as model deployment and putting them into the production while data scientists are more related to model building. Data scientists must have proficient knowledge of data mining algorithms like bagging, boosting, generalized linear model, deep learning and some statistical concepts. While machine learning engineers need solid understanding of software development life cycle plus some basic knowledge of feature engineering and model building. Now we have seen the differences between these two roles. Let's move further and check the roles and responsibility expected from each role. Roles and responsibilities. The main objective of both of these positions to use the data and solve complex problems. However, the difference lies in terms of their responsibilities. Let me give you guys a brief overview about the responsibility of each of these roles. Now, let's get into roles and responsibility of a machine learning engineer. Think of a machine learning engineer as a specialized software engineer with the knowledge of machine learning. Machine learning engineer uses basic data science knowledge to put the model into the production. Now, let's discuss some general responsibilities of a machine learning engineer. ML engineers are responsible for handling software architecture and data pipeline end to end and make sure data flows smoothly into the production. They also work with stakeholder to understand more business needs and scope. Post production, ML engineers also work on eliminating errors and deploying the model successfully. They also do some kind of model optimization. The part of some of the data science work is also machine learning engineers responsibility. Now we have understood the roles and responsibility of an ML engineer. Let's do the same for the data scientist. According to Harvard Business Review, data scientists spend 80% of their time in just cleaning of the data and rest 20% in model building and validation. On a lighter note, data scientists are one step ahead of data analysts whose primary responsibility is to collect the data, examine and find unique trends. In many business scenarios, these terms data scientist and data analyst are interchangeable. Here are some of the general responsibility of the data scientist. Data scientists are responsible to examine the data and find the valuable extract out of it. That means you need to spend time with the data. Next is about features. You have to find the right measurable features from the data. After you find the features, you have to build the predictive models. Once the model is ready, you have to show your result to the stakeholders for the approvals. And finally, you also have to work with data engineering team to make sure your model work properly in the deployment environment. These are some generic responsibilities of an ML engineer and a data scientist. Now let me tell you what a role of ML engineer and data scientist look in an organization like Twitter. Twitter look for machine learning engineers who can improve their existing search and recommendation engine. They should also know about user intent for business relevancy. And they also need to team up with software engineering and data science team to put the ML solution in Twitter's tech stack. As a data scientist in Twitter, you will get the access to the Twitter data which you can use to design and deploy your statistical models. You can use machine learning, deep learning and graph approaches to identify relevancy between people and show them the right content. You also need to know about crowdsourcing and some of the labeling efforts so that you can reduce the human approaches. So this is about day-to-day -day responsibility of ML engineer and data scientist. Now let's look at the compensation what is offered on these roles in different regions. First. Let's look into the salary of a machine learning engineer. According to Glassdoor, the average yearly income of an ML engineer in United States is $131,000. Meanwhile, in UK, 51,000 pounds and in India, it is 8.9 lakhs. Now, we have understood the salary of an ML engineer. Let's do the same for the data scientist. According to Glassdoor, 
the average yearly compensation for data scientists in United States is $117,000. Meanwhile, in UK, it's £46,000 and in India, it is 11 lakhs. Although both of these career options have very similar salary range, but we can say both are very well rewarding career options. By now, I believe you get a better understanding of what is the difference between these two roles. Now, if you're convinced enough to pursue either of them, let's take what is the ideal roadmap for these roles. Roadmap for an ML engineer. Programming language is a necessary skill for ML engineers. If you want to put your model into the production, you need some kind of coding language. Not only the language knowledge, but also you need some libraries like TensorFlow, PyTorch that can help you put your model into the production. I have two programming language options for you guys, Python and R. Python is the most popular language for data scientists. It uses everywhere, including Google, Amazon, Instagram, Facebook, and many other tech companies. These companies also provided some great set of libraries like TensorFlow, PyTorch, OpenCV, PySpark to make your life easier. With the help of Python, you don't need to focus on writing code from the scratch. You can just use these libraries and focus on your business impact. R is the second most popular language for machine learning engineers. With over 2 million users and 18,000 plus open source packages, R is very much popular in statistical inferences and building the model visualizations. With the IDE support like R Studio, generating graphs and managing the library is very easy. Not a big fan of coding? Don't worry. Machine learning can be done with the help of some graphical interfaces like BigML and Weka. However, some basic coding skills are needed to enter in the field of machine learning. If you want to specialize in machine learning, you don't need a lot of mathematics because you have a lot of libraries and packages available. But a good knowledge of linear algebra, probability calculus will make you a great machine learning engineer. Machine learning algorithms needs data to solve business problems. Data cleaning is a crucial part in machine learning. A clean data can multiply the performance of your model. The tasks needed in data cleaning are handling the missing data, handling the outliers, removing the bad data, and fixing the structural errors. The next phase of machine learning engineer's roadmap is to learn machine learning concepts. You need to have some basic knowledge of supervised learning, unsupervised learning, and reinforcement learning. Once you are done with learning algorithm, the last step in this roadmap is to learn about deep learning. Deep learning contains deep neural network that is used to solve some highly complex tasks. For example, today is speech recognition, voice recognition, natural language processing, computer vision, face recognition, all uses deep learning techniques. Roadmap for a data scientist. Mathematics is the backbone of data science. If you are a beginner and you want to become a data scientist, you need a strong foundation in mathematics. That includes some of the concepts like linear algebra, probability, differential equations, metric decomposition, and calculus. Mathematics is more enjoyable when you put your work into the actions. There are a good number of libraries available which have ready-made functions for you to use. For that, you need some basic programming language. I recommend you to start with Python because that has the most useful libraries and a lot of functions are predefined. Once you mastered coding, the next step in this roadmap is to learn about algorithms. You can start with supervised learning algorithm. After that, you can go for unsupervised learning and reinforcement learning. Once you complete this, you can go for deep learning algorithm. You should also know about parameters of your model so that you can tune it for the improved performance. You also need to know about the key differences between different algorithms. You might have heard this popular phrase, jack of all trade, master of none. Like everyone, data scientists also have their own biases. They are very well versed in some of the specific subdomains like natural language processing or computer vision. I recommend you to work with different professionals and build your knowledge in different data science areas and applications. Practice makes one perfect. As you practice your skills on more data science problem and data sets, your skill will improve. Wondering where and how to start your data science and machine learning journey? Scalar has a perfect solution for you. Join Scalar's data science and machine learning program and land to your dream job. That's it from my side. Hope you find this video insightful. If you like the video, don't forget to do a comment and like. Also, if you want to keep receiving such updates, follow Scalar. Signing off, thank you.